And Look, all of them, all, you all of them in Lagos, Let me all of you. them in Nigeria. Listen to me. Nobody when I'm talking, no. you keep quiet. An arrogant customer who is not ashamed. Pastor Donald, why are you not picking my calls? Why haven't you paid the, the balance up till now? Telling the Honorable Court that I have not been calling him, I have not been picking his call. It's a fabricated fallacy. He did this just to debase me. You are only, and you are the one that is being arrogant at the same time. A Nollywood veteran hopes to diversify into marine transportation. Passenger boat, I did not see. My money, I did not see. I wanted to report him to Amadiona. He was testing the boats, wanting to want in the boat sink with engine. The husband does not like the responsibilities, but he likes all the pleasures a woman has to offer. I still the lip now. First, the lip person will bump it. And you go control. The dispute is real, and the judgment is binding. This is the justice court. Continuing, the plaintiff, Yetunde, is asking the court to compel the defendant to be responsible for the upkeep of their children. I left him about four years ago because he's not responsible towards the kids, towards me and everything. They were living together? Before. Yes. I met this um, lady around 2012 to 13. We got married. We did, the, we, did our, we did our introduction and on um, April 24, 2014. So we started living together. I'm the one that rented the apartment. We were living there at Jego. So at the time goes on, I do normally sell cement or those building machines. There's one thing I can get from what you have said now. When you got married, you were actually working and earning income. Yeah, Beverly. He brought his brother to come and be staying with us. After that time, he brought another guy to come and be staying with us. So, oh, and, he doesn't, uh, and he doesn't do anything. So, I took my brother. Because he said he wanted to go to Arabic school. And I took her to Isolo. He didn't normally go in the morning and come in the night. So, along the line, we do live together. The only thing you know how to do is to just work dress up, wear cap and go out, that is it. He doesn't care about anything in the house. So he forgot the phone on the dining. I now scroll through the phone. I now saw her chatting with a guy. So I said, oh, what's the meaning of all this? He now kneeled down. She kneeled down and said, she's sorry. I said, there's nothing there. I want to ask, when you say chatting with a guy, yeah. Is the context something offensive or unbecoming? As like in, woman? like doing something because with they, a guy, ma. As in, as in chatting with a the guy. They are changing their number. They are, they are talking. About, I want to be your date. The guy said he wanted to be his own date. Okay. So he now said, okay, she have accepted. Okay. I saw all those messages. So immediately, she said, she now she knew that when I caught her, I said, she's sorry. That kind of thing, you know, we never happen again. And I went to the, my brother place last day, December. I saw school bag, two school bag. He dropped them for, for there. I'm not calling that. Okay, now you drop school bag for your children. The only thing you know they are going to school. Provide for them. If it is only one person school fees, you can pay. Pay. Last year, April, he, called, he asked me to send my account details. I sent it to him. He started sending me 5,000 every month. The plaintiff, Yetunde, left her husband four years ago. She alleges he was not responsible and was violent towards her. The defendant, Tijani, alleges that he caught the plaintiff flirting with another man on social media. He claims that he has never laid a finger on his wife. He also said he was providing for the family before Yetunde moved out of their matrimonial home. George Fumi waits into this matter. Ma, this woman unite with the, the lady, they wanted to be collecting money from me. And I said, I cannot pay. The last thing I can do is that if you give me my kids, I will know what to do. She said, I do not take it. Let me come in here. Because when it comes to the welfare of the children, it's always paramount for me, regardless of what's going on between the two of you. Right now, the children are going to the regular school. Right? Exactly. Right now, the two of you 
we don't mind the children going to the Arabic classes, which is okay. Now, you have the issue of lesson teacher there, right? I'm not aware of that one. She, she just mentioned that she now. She mentioned it, but I'm now. not aware. Not initially. Uh -huh. I'm not aware. Just aware. mentioned that now. Is that not what you said now? Okay. So, as the father, you pay direct to the school. You are literate. You, are, you can walk. You can move around. Walk into the school. Find out how much it is. Pay into the account directly. Do you understand me? When you pay, make photocopy of payments and bring it to the legal team here. Okay, ma'am. Do you understand? I understand. Pay that. direct. That way we are sure. And that is it. But when was the last time you saw your children? March 15th. March? I saw them on the 20th of this month. 20th? Of, of last month. 20. What's the agreement you have over that? When you want them, you call her and she brings them over. No, she didn't make my call. Before I blocked her number. I was surprised when, when, when she gave my number to the teacher. I was surprised. She because whenever I called her. She blocked your number or you blocked I her? I blocked that myself because Why? whenever I called her, she do not used to pick my call. Immediately she left. I normally call her. How is my kid? He said, Show How do you see your children? When you he said, Show Lomon Bini. You said, talk. You get your chance to speak. He said, Show, show Lomon Bini. Do you have children with me? Exactly. That is what she said. So along the line, Maybe uh, last year, after she sent the account number, after she got the alert, the first payment I said, I, we started talking. She started talking to me. I can't go to one. I still ask her, this is, this is our last chat. I said, how are my kids? She did not respond. A few days ago. Have you demanded, ever demanded to see the children and she deprived you from having access to them? I asked her about the, I asked her. Ask uh, the, about their work. The, the, the description, from... I want to see the kids. Okay. Even though I sent, I, buy, I bought some clothes, I sent it to my brother. To, my, my brother said she saw her one day, she didn't normally saw her, and I bought the uh, clothes to go and give her. She told my brother, after I even called my brother, I helped. No, he said, but wait, My listen, brother said, he said, to, he, don't, he doesn't want clothes. Me. Listen to me, I'm convinced that you have the welfare of your children at heart. Ma, in my building, up to now, I still have their, their sandals in my, in my building. I bought it. I know she will not collect it. Just some have dashed it out. Ma, the don't bag dash that, them out. The bag, the, the bag I bought, I sent someone who went to Do US. Do you collect? You know, you the, the bag, is, is, they are using the bag in the school. When I went there, I met the bag. The bag. She, now, she now called me and said, bag below the blue kutora. Me, lo. And I met, I met uh, the bag with, with Hold those on. kids. Hold on, just a minute. I want to let you know. Go. I left him about four years ago. When I left him, both him, years. both him, both him, his mother, his father, no one of them have ever called that I want to speak with these children. No one. Are you going to pick? No one. My brother used to call my brother is living in Jogu. My brother used to call him. I'm not concerned about the family. I'm concerned about, about the him. family. My brother used to call him. So leave the your in My brother used to call him. I asked him. You have his are you taking care of your kids? Are you paying their bills? Who are you paying their school fees? Brahma, should you used to call you every time? I don't have a number. You used to lie. No, you I don't have a number. Like, when listen, you wait, me. listen to me. This Brahma should. It's not an issue about a third party. I'm not interested in whatever any third party has to say or do with regards to your children or your relationship. And what I want to ask you, is it true that when he buys things for the children, you don't allow them to use it? He didn't buy anything. What? That's one. Two. Do you give him access to the children? He didn't ask me. Good. Now you want access to your children? Yes, Alima. Good. When do you want the access to your children? Any time from now. And you said you saw them recently too. On the 20th of last month. They still recognize you as their dad. Exactly. They still recognize you. Uh, I don't know what it means. Like, no, no. If they do, His father could If they him. don't recognize him as their dad, then it's about time you let them recognize him as their dad. You have to build that up. If it's the other way around, I'll do the same thing. But right now, he said he need access to the children. We're going to work that one out right away. Upkeep for the children. How much do you want to be given her on a monthly basis for the two children, apart from the school fees? If he wants to help out, right, and you are not allowing 
That means you are depriving them from having the best they can have. If you refuse to support her as well, that means is this, you are guilty of the same thing. If you don't want to stay together, if you don't want to date each other, if you don't want to I'm stay married. married to each other, look, I wasn't there when the two of you met and decided I'm to married. get married. So if you wake up one day, non, neither of you is under age, but you must be responsible for the children you brought into the world. Do you understand? And that's where my concern is. So school fees, I've told you what to do with it, and you bring it. Then the upkeep, how much do you want to be giving on a monthly basis for the children's upkeep? Then we come back, we now come back to the issue of how to share, do you understand, the, having access to the children with you and now during holiday, and even weekends, if you want. So let's tidy up the monetary aspects. That's the only one remaining. How much? No, I'll be giving them um, 10,000 monthly. How much were you giving them before? I normally give them 5,000 naira. But now you want to be giving that 10,000 10, naira. Is that acceptable to you? No. How much do you want? If you say something is no. No, not wait, giving... just wait. How much do you want? Cannot be giving me 10,000 naira every month. You can't tell me you okay. cannot be giving me 10,000 naira. If all the ends in the month is 15,000 naira. Where do you expect him to get extra money? So you can't just say that unless you can prove to me that he's, he's capable of giving you more than 10,000 naira. What I spend on them for monthly basis is more than 10,000. How much do you spend on them? I can't, no, I cannot calculate it because... So how do I make him pay? If you cannot calculate... No, let me say the truth. Um, I cannot pay more than 10,000 naira. You can't tell me you cannot pay more than 10,000 naira either. I'm sorry, The same way she cannot tell me that I cannot... Um, accept 10,000 naira. Neither of you can tell me that. Okay, ma. So when, we, when you were living together, how much were you giving then on a monthly basis? It doesn't give me anything. Okay. All this thing is there is just lying. Mommy. It doesn't give me... We do respect, ma. It doesn't give Tell me anything. Tell us to go and print our last statement of account from January, uh, from January you know, 2017 you know, to 2018. You know what's going to happen? It doesn't give me anything. Hold on. Wait. Before she left. Just hold on. I want you to be truthful to yourself and to the courts because I'm going to demand for that. If you don't print out, he can print out his own. Sorry. And you know the debit will be there. <laughs> Where the money goes to will be written there. So you don't have to lie about anything. I'm not saying you are lying. Do you understand? Just be transparent. And even you too. You don't have to lie about anything. I can put mine. So, so how much were you giving her then? I'm giving her 10,000 naira. Four months, 40,000 naira. You then you give me 10,000 naira weekly. That's what he yeah, said. He wants to start giving you 10,000 naira. That's what he said then. So she starts giving me that 10,000 naira. So let me print my silver. Order! He used to give you 10,000 naira. Yes, that was his said, which he had not know about. He said he used to give you 10,000. But now, week. look, so now I understand you. He said he used to give you 10,000 naira before. You don't agree with that. But you heard that he wants to be giving 10,000 10, naira now. A week. Which not is per not. Month. Now. Per, month. Per, per week. Per month. I said per ah. month. No, you, you said per week. 10,000 naira. Oh, damn. Before then, I don't want to give her 10,000 per week because mm. two of my brother is staying with you that. You want to give 10,000 naira per month. Exactly. This present ah. Nigeria. Mommy, this I'm Lagos. Mommy, I don't like to be lying. I'm married. It's not about lying. Oh, damn. Let me tell you something. Comfort, luxury, style, class, tranquility, and nature. The ideal home for today's game changers has all these and more. Looking for more? Then look no further than Master's Villa. An ultra-modern luxury estate nestled in the very heart of the Lekki Peninsula. The avant-garde architectural styles of our homes and villas reflects a lifestyle that is both exclusive and intuitive. So, are you looking for more? Then look no further than Pazino Homes and Gardens. Call us today on these numbers. Pazino Homes and Gardens, your choice today.
-hmm. As long as you are old enough to impregnate a woman and bring a child into the world, then you must be responsible for the upkeep of that child. It's not just that I'm saying that that's the law. And the court is here to enforce it. So, come up with something. Let's run this off. It's I a said, straightforward thing. Okay. You, you don't even have a, much conflict. I'll be giving her 15000 monthly. I said it's not acceptable to the court. I can easily award any amount I want, and I can enforce yes, it. Yes, I know. I know. I'm just giving. It's not right. You don't have that right. It's a privilege you are uh, enjoying now. No. I'm giving that opportunity Ma, to come up. Uh, I know. Okay. But this was a situation on grant. Because I don't like, I don't like whereby I would make a promise and I won't fulfill it. Exactly. You don't, if you don't, if you don't, that's what I'm telling you, you don't have a choice over there. Because, because it's not a promise. Exactly. You are not making a promise. It's a duty. What you must do. And if you don't do it, there's a punishment for it. No. But, um, the law, under the law, there's a punishment for it. And the law will be affected. But if my wife took me here again, I will face another panel. That's why you should mind. You should be careful the number of children you have. Uh, if you can't fend for them, then you hold your trousers together. Two kids, I have two kids at home as well. Order. Again. What did you say? I have two kids at home again now. You, you chose to. You chose to. I'll be you chose to. Do you understand? You chose to. It's a choice you made. I'll be married. It's a choice you made. You made that choice. Nobody forced you. Exactly. But so you I'm can't say because you have other children, then the first set of children will be neglected. Exactly. Or they will not be entitled to because what I, they ordinarily they should be entitled to. to settle this thing amicably if anything is there. What do you say? I call her when, when she left, when she packed everything. It's not working, it's not working. Don't go there. Don't, don't even go there. You've moved on. So what are you saying for your wife or your new wife now to be listening to this that you are even trying to make up or what? What, what are you trying to bring up? Okay, let me, I'll be giving her 20,000 monthly now. 20,000 naira. We start with 20,000 naira. 20,000 naira. You take care of the school fees, right? I won't be the one to take care of the school You take care of the school fees because you know why I said that. When you take care of the school fees, who buys clothes for them? You think it's after that 20,000 naira should get money to buy the clothes for the children? Ordinarily, I don't know where she's residing. It's because she didn't make demand for it. You should be paying for the rent. But you see, because she didn't go there, that's why I just left it. Do you understand? I can't decide to even make you pay the rent. But she didn't go there. So I know, in a way, she's working out her rent. And remember, you are supposed to put roof over those children's head, but she's the one putting the roof right now. So it's not as if she's not making any contribution at all. You wrote there that you love to have, take possession of your children. I told you you can't have that. Exactly. You can't, more so now that you haven't told me that there's another woman in the house. There's no way I allow those children to come down there. I'm not saying she's a bad woman, but when their mother is alive and she has her own children, do you understand me? And the two of you are not even on good. That's the issue. You understand me? I understand you. For the sake of the children, the two of you have to learn how to relate together without any acrimony. For now, thank God for technology and modern age. You don't have to give her physically the cash. You can always transfer the money to our accounts. Now, when do you want to have access to the children? When they, when they, if I need them, I will go and pick them. But when they were in holiday, I can go and pick them. So for holiday period? Yep. So now they stay with you until holiday period. And when you want them... And, you're... Please, ma, tell her to give me the address. Whenever I want to check on them. You can't, you can't command me to tell her. Okay, ma. Sorry, ma. Sorry, ma. Do you understand? Sorry, ma. So what you that please there's like you want to have the address of where? Where they are where they were living. Where they are living. That might be dicey. You know why I say that? You have moved on. 
if she wants to move on, she can't keep, start having you. If whoever she's dating or start coming around, keep seeing you there, how do you think the guy will feel? The same way she can't come to your house anyhow. You can't go there anyhow too. Do you understand? So you see them in school. You can always see the children in school. George Fumi encourages the separated couple to learn how to relate without acrimony for the sake of their children. After the break, George Fumi wraps this matter up. We've addressed all the issues. Right? So now, we've agreed. You pay the school fees direct. I will make an inquiry. Let me. If there's medical bill on neither of the children, you pay direct to the hospital. And you have to know. You, it's not like you wake up and just call him and say, oh, last week I took the children to the hospital and I paid so, so, so amount of money. No. I'm about taking the children to the hospital. This is where I'm going. Do you understand me? He has the opportunity of either coming or not coming. If he choose not to come, he will pay. If he choose to come, he will still pay. But know that you will not carry him along ahead. Unless he decides to give you the money directly, you are to pay into the hospital's account. Do you understand? But if there's something to be bought, send it to him, let him know. He might decide to, you know, to hasten things. He might decide to send the money to you to go and purchase and quickly give the child in the, God forbid. But, you know, we have to just consider everything that is likely to happen, you know. So, school fees direct to the school. If there's hospital bill, you pick it up. First week of every month, you pay her 20,000 Naira. Yeah. Holiday period for the children, you share equally. The first part for you, the latter part for you. If it's two weeks, that means the first one week and the second week with you. Do you understand me? Comfort, luxury, style, class, tranquility, and nature. The ideal home for today's game changers has all these and more. Looking for more? Then look no further than Master's Villa. An ultra-modern luxury estate nestled in the very heart of the Lekki Peninsula. The avant-garde architectural styles of our homes and villas reflects a lifestyle that is both exclusive and intuitive. So, are you looking for more? Then look no further than Pozino Homes and Gardens. Call us today on these numbers. Pozino Homes and Gardens, your choice today. But while the children are here, you give her access to speak with the children. And when they are with you, you have access to speak with the children on phone too. Do you understand me? The last thing is about the public holiday. The first day to her and the second day to her. That's it. All right. Have you been cheated or have a dispute and want justice? Don't take laws into your hands. Log on to www.thejusticecourt.com and submit your case.